Say hi, Coyote. Okay, tonight we got hobo cooking with Uncle Space Dude. Cheap style. So what we have here is, of course, just like Julia Childs, the old uh, English lady that used to do the cooking show, and she'd drink a ton of wine and get hella wasted. That's what we're doing tonight. Absolutely no reservations. Okay, so we began the day with... A bottle of tequila this bottle here is a fifth and a half in weight it's uh, 960 milliliters so there's actually a fifth and a half worth of booze in that then oh I got that for uh, 22 and a half pesos so that's like a dollar 80 then I got this is just beginning the hobo cook off. I got a Coca Cola. As you can see, I want to I want to show you these. It's the great. They're great big ones, glass bottles. The great big glass bottles uh, for eight eight pesos, which is about fifty five or sixty cents. I don't know why, but Coca Colas in glass bottles are hella cheap here. If you have an old bottle to return when you buy a new one, okay? Now, for the rest of the shopping. Of course, we have to have a little candy. I already ate one, but here's one. It's a tamarindo spoon. It's tamarindo on a plastic spoon. It's like this fruit, and it's like a real hard hard uh, jelly, but it's super hard. Not super hard. It's pretty soft and squishy. It's good. It's fruit. When I open it, I'll show it to you. Just has plastic with a rubber band around a plastic spoon of it. Then I got one of these. And this has, uh, this here has uh, spicy, salty chili on the outside of it. And then on the inside is hard mango candy. You've probably seen these before. They taste like icky, salty uh, chili on the outside. But then once you get through it, it, you got some nice, yummy mango hard candy. Then, I only had a couple dollars left on my visa. It wasn't enough to pull out actual money. So I had to go shopping at the little convenience store, the Oxo here, which means box. So it's the box. Okay. So then I got these. They look like, uh, oh, here we go. That's better when I get a little shade on it. They look like crackers, but they're not. As you can see, there's like milk splash there. Uh, they're like a cracker, but they're a cookie. They taste like uh, vanilla and lemon a little bit. And they're good for dunking in milk or coffee or uh, tea. And these were 11 pesos, so like 90 cents. Then I got crackettes. These are the generic Ritz. A uh, great big ass pack of them, as you can see, the length of my freaking, the length of my freaking arm. Big old packet of them. I got two two packets of them. They're eleven pesos each. That's ninety cents each. So this is this is the hobo package. What you can get for a couple bucks. Then I got refried beans. Two big cans of it. I bought that. Uh, that's plenty of refried beans. Two big cans. Uh, they were 11 pesos each, which is 90 cents each. Actually, it's a little less. That's uh, 11 pesos is actually like 80 cents. So basically, 80 cents, 80 cents, 80 cents, 80 cents, 80 cents. You can see a pattern here, you know. Oh, these were four pesos. The tamarindo spoons, that's like oh, 25 cents or 30 cents. And then these are two pesos, which is like fucking 15 cents, 10 cents. Okay, and then I got me a 18 pack of the big ass tortillas. Nice white flour soft tortillas. Big old 18 pack of them for uh, 16 and a half pesos, which is a dollar, oh, like a dollar 20. Yeah, let's see, 12. Yeah, like a dollar twenty-five. 
So that's what I got for the hobo package for the night. And I'm gonna get to cooking. Hold up a sec, I'll open this tamarindo spoon so you can see it. Wait one second, watch Yodi. Watch watch Yodi fucking eye in my food. See if I can prop this up so it'll stay. You can watch Yodi fucking sniffing the fucking food out. Here we go. Leave it for yeah. Here. You can watch Yodi sniff the food out while I while I open the tamarindo spoon. I like the little rubber bands I use them for my hair. I actually have a little ponytail, a little rat tail. It has a big piece of plastic on it. And then it just has a rubber band wrapped around it on a, a little white, cheesy little white uh, camp style plastic spoon. It's good though. It's like a concentrated extract of the fruit. Oh, I know what it's like. It kind of tastes like it too, but better. Not quite as bitter. Um, as you can see here, now I got the spoon with the plastic and shit off. Uh, it has the texture of cranberry. Or like, uh, you know, the cranberries... Uh, Stuff you can when it when it's firm, it's like gelatinous. It has that texture, but it's a little firmer than that. And it even has like beans in it or like seeds or whatever, like cranberries would too. It's probably related to a cranberry, but it is no, no, no. Tamarindos are like a big ass fruit, but it's the concentrated extract, and it has some seeds and shit in it in the spoon. So I'm gonna devour this. Probably give Yodi a few crackers or cookies or whatever, and then I'm gonna cook my grub piece. I'll uh, be back with another video to cook grub. We'll do hobo style burritos. I'll show you how Uncle Space Dude will get hella stone on some weed and uh, cook up these refried beans, mash up the fucking Ritz crackers and mix it in with the refried beans and then eat it on tortillas. Now see if I had a top ramen, I would put like two top ramens in with that even. This is going to be like poundage, dude. Like, fucking, I'm going to have to fucking shit so bad tonight or in the morning and shit, probably. <laughs> that's pure shit. But it's stuff that's good for you. These are loaded. These uh, Ritz crackers are loaded with butter and stuff, uh, dairy products, butters and greases and shit. And the beans are like pure protein. And these are, well, these are flour tortillas, so they ain't that great. And the corn ones are super good for you, but. My pure protein hobo supper is another recipe uh, altogether I'd have to show you on another night. Alright, so when I get to cooking, I'll do another video. Peace.